Well, I'm Pat Shields. I'm a member of North Pacific Yearly Meeting, and I live in Portland, Oregon. I began asking myself, what could I do to make FCNL better known? It took a year of seasoning as I spoke with my discernment friends about traveling to small meetings and talking about our work. Basically, I used the website for background material, and I reread every piece of literature I had. It was dry as dirt. <laughs> so back to the staff and their input was to put more of myself into the presentation, personalizing the material, telling about my spirituality, adding who I am, why I care about FCNL. People have been very receptive to these presentations. I get people who call me afterwards and have a follow-up question. When I'm speaking with friends, and I tell them about how many people get our action alerts, how many people receive our emails, and how many people go on lobby visits. And when they find out how many other Quakers are out there working, they get inspired. And I also talk about how I see FCNL helping me live out my spiritual needs of reflection and action. I ask responses, both positive and negative, to the word lobby or lobbyist. And we get some pretty strong words sometimes, but it helps to unpack the emotions. I made assumptions about people's questions. I thought people would want to know, are we really a Quaker organization? And no one has asked me that question. I thought people would like to know about the financials, but no one ever asked me about that. People do ask me about how do we get an appointment? Uh, do members of Congress read the emails? How is it to sit down and talk with a member of Congress? How do we know when we're successful? I show this picture of my grandchildren and talk about the fact that I'm concerned about the world I'm leaving for my grandchildren and your grandchildren as well. As you embark on this venture, I'd suggest that you really make use of our staff. They can help you come prepared with a specific issue their member of Congress is concerned with and to help build a relationship with that member of Congress because it's relationship building that we're really after. Show your passion for your work. They want to know what you have to say, so speak your truth.